After you check to make sure the scene is safe and you get to the victim, next you want to assess consciousness by tapping and shouting, hey, hey, are you okay? If there's no response, I'd call help or for 911. And next I want to do a head tilt, chin lift, so I can look, listen, and feeling for breathing for no more than five seconds. After that, with my pocket mask, I would give two breaths. This is an adult. Do the head tilt with my pocket mask on and give two breaths, one second. After that, keeping the head tilted back, I would check the carotid pulse for no more than 10 seconds. If the victim has a pulse but is not breathing, I would now need to do one breath every five seconds for an adult. <sighs> Keeping the head back, one, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand. <sighs> One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, inhale. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand. Do this until up to two minutes. After the breath on the two minutes, with the head tilted back, for every breath, you would check the pulse, reassess the pulse. If they still have a pulse and are not breathing, you would continue rescue breathing. For the adult, one breath at every five seconds. If they do not have a pulse, you would do CPR. You would continue all of this until uh, EMS arrives or uh, someone other equally trained or higher trained than you. If it gets to, you get exhausted or if the scene becomes unsafe. That's it.